Okay, here's the bow that I just finished making. It's uh, made out of hazel wood, um, like hazelnuts. Uh, I cut the sapling down myself. Those are my arrows too. I make those all by hand. Five inch shield cut feathers, uh, high back shield, and uh, these are poplar. I have uh, same arrows with broadheads on them, but uh, the bow that I made here, this uh, this is made with the bark on that I made from a sapling that I cut, and uh, I wrapped a piece of suede, and I'm using that also one piece, uh, and using that also as an arrow rest. We'll see how that works. I can always cut it later if I don't like it. I stained it up because the wood itself is a creamy white color, and I just have a feeling that if I were to uh, fling some arrows with that, that the deer would probably figure out that that's uh, what's causing them that pain. Anyway, the bark on the side, uh, I don't know if you can see it real good because of the glare of the sun, but anyway, there's some spots on the bark that are that are kind of light colored I stained it with some leather stain actually it's called chocolate but it was dad's that he gave me and it was 30 years old and uh, chances are good that that uh, because it's 30 years old caused the color to be a little off but anyway, I'm pretty proud of it. It, uh, it draws smooth as silk. And uh, ugh, I don't like it when I turn the camera like that. It would make you dizzy, wouldn't it? So anyway, it ends up uh, 72 inches knock to knock. And uh, anyway, I'm going to do some shooting.